Well, today we are celebrating milestones here at News Channel 11. 68 years of broadcasting for WJHL, mm -hmm. and that will be a celebration we continue through the evening. But we are also pausing right now to mark a big milestone for you. Mm -hmm. Don't leave. Don't I, leave. I just want to run. Stay right here. <laughs> um, we're going to do something that I know you don't enjoy, and that's talking about you and what you mean to the station and to this entire region. But As I mean, work anniversaries go, it's a big one. Two decades, and now I'm working with people that I'm old enough to be their parents, <laughs> or a really cool young aunt. Right. And I'll go with that. yeah, I like that one better. Um, but it's it's been a whirlwind. It's it's gone by so quickly. Mornings with Sarah Diamond, asking questions. A whirlwind that started when she left her home in Iowa for TV news jobs in Texas and Oklahoma. It was a throw me into the deep end and I either sink or swim. Uh, but it was the best experience I could have had. Then in 2001, Sarah and her husband got the call from WJHL. We didn't know how long we were going to be here. This was kind of a stepping stone in, in our careers. And 20 years later, we're, we're still here. Along the way, she's covered the biggest local stories of the generation, becoming a fixture at WJHL TV, beloved around the region. And something else happened. Viewers literally saw me grow <laughs> and um, they were very supportive. And I, I really appreciate that. The Diamond family grew. First a little boy, then a little girl. And those who work with Sarah know nothing matters more. Sometimes you'll see my son on our news during sports, and it's surreal, but I, I'm so proud of both of them. And, you know, they, they've been very patient with me and, and my career and what I have to do. Um, so they're just, they're number one a priority for me. When she's not keeping up with her kids, she's staying strong and inspiring others to be healthy too. But it's her strength as a journalist that helps lead the newsroom. I can talk to our younger coworkers, and I can say, you know, okay, I know this seems awful right now, but you're going to get through it. It's going to be okay, and you know, lead them in a direction that's that's going to be all right. And even when the camera isn't rolling, she is the fiercest of advocates for the people watching from home. Our viewers are loyal. Our viewers are wonderful. They've stuck with us, you know, for years, for 20 years, and they deserve to have the most accurate information because uh, they tune in to us every night. It's the least we can do. Um, it's, it's what we need to do. She hasn't left yet, but uh, no. literally we were home. I was hiding behind him. With, thank you. Some of those old photos. Uh -huh. Yikes. Oh, and of your kids, which has been such oh, the thing. That just brought tears to my and eyes. so much fun. Love them. We have joked that many people would never imagine the number of times you have coordinated dinner <laughs> and rides and pickups during commercial Logistics. breaks. Oh, yeah. I'm always on the horn, <laughs> you know, texting or whatever, making sure everybody's where they need to be. Seamless. Yeah. Smooth as glass. Happy anniversary. It's been a great 20 years. Yeah, here's a 20 more. Absolutely. Now,